So the move I'm gonna show you right now is gonna help you if the guy is coming in for the takedown and sprawls, or if you're in the classroom setting and you start your wrestling in the knee position. The way I'm gonna teach it is from the knee position. You'll be able to figure out how to do this from a hundred different ways. So what I'm gonna do to make this work is I'm gonna use my left hand to slap the neck and push his head into my arm. When I grab him, I'm grabbing his chin with my right arm right here. I'm gonna take my left hand, I'm gonna grab his wrist, I'm gonna create a hole right here, I'm gonna take my head, shove it through the hole, keeping a hold of his neck, set his arm on his chest, and I'm gonna pull his neck to break his neck. So the move and the pressure, I'm taking his head and I'm turning it this way. I have his neck scooped, all my body weight is compressing down on him, and I'm gonna pull and lean, which will break the neck. So always be careful with your partner. All right, I've done this on many guys who didn't think it would work, and it's wrecked their neck. This is the first move I ever did to get disqualified for a competition for doing a neck crank. So the way it's gonna work, look, I'm right here. My weight is down on top of him. This hand is under, and I'm holding his chin. All I have to do is lean back, and I'm putting all this pressure, so I'm gonna pull and break. So we'll do it one more time. We'll do it at this angle so you get a little different view. So, like I said, there's many entrants you can use. One is I just do the slap and grab. So I have it here, I slap him and I grab. Now as you can see, look, I'm holding his chin right here. If he has a goatee or a beard, I really like grabbing that because that makes a good steering wheel handle. So I have him on his chin, take my right hand, hold it tight, take my left hand, I'm gonna grab his wrist. So when I grab, I'm creating a hole and I'm gonna duck through it. So all in one fluid motion, I just do this. Here we are, lay across him. I can walk him over wherever. If he's moving, I'm riding him. Now I have it and I crank it up right here. This move can also be done from the sprawling situation. If we're standing and as he comes to tap me, look, I push and I drive down. Here he is, I'm here. Immediately, I'm holding his head, I'm gonna grab, shoot, turn, roll on top, and face out right here. I have all this crank, boom, to pull his neck. This is one of my favorite moves to do for the sprawl counter, but always be careful with it because you could hurt your partner's neck.